Play, it's uh, very fun. earthy. Yeah. Woo. Hello, Al. Smells mm-hmm. like my dog had a bad meal. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Usually when I smell that, I'm in bed at night, my wife says, did you walk the dog? Oh, no. Well, you know, hey. My wife wants to smell it. Yeah, but you know what? You don't have you a dog. Taking its natural aura. Mm. Oh, my God. I love it. Mm. Steve, were mm-hmm. you eating beans? <laughs> Who cut the cheese? <laughs> it's just the kale, people. Oh my God! Oh, all right, let's let's you know what? Let's you know. Let's bag it back up. Let's bag it back up. Tastes much better this. than it smells. Mm-hmm. That's a good thing, all right. Well, you know what? So now I'm seeing kale Caesar salad at restaurants. Well, you know what? The uh, restaurants want to be in style, and it you know it really kale has been around for years and years. And I'm back in the '80s. I used to use it as a plate garnish and to um, garnish the the salad. Um, bar when I worked at the Brown Derby. Imagine that. No one ate kale back then. No one. Even I didn't no because one. I didn't. I wasn't as knowledgeable. I thought it was just a you know a a very very tough piece What's of cream. What's your favorite way to have kale? Well, I love it baked with olive oil. But my favorite way is the Tuscan kale salad. When you put olive oil, lemon juice, hot pepper flakes, tomatoes, grape tomatoes, chop it up, pecorino cheese, lemon juice. It's amazing. Toss it up, have oh, some baby. friends. I'm making it tomorrow at RDK. Really? Engineering, yeah. Wow. Yeah, so it's been really a great, it's break, going to break spring. So now, the, so now those who haven't heard you before, they're like, she's making this at R- RDK, did you say? Yes. So they were saying, who is this woman and what does she do? Well, I obviously have to keep hustling because I need in, an introduction. So what I do is I go to corporate wellness companies and I do cooking demos, fitness events. I do a total wellness package. So employees yoga, can get meditation. healthier. Well, I, I don't teach yoga, but I do yoga poses because I am certified uh, group exercise and body pump and also a personal trainer and a registered dietitian. But it's a total wellness package. So yesterday I was at Woods Hole's Oceanographic Institute and we were doing well, squats. Your I love them, but no, but I go to Chubb Insurance now. I go to Grace Construction. I go to Old Mutual in the city. I'm going to talk about um, how to debunk fad diets because there's so many fad diets out today. Nice. It's crazy. People nice. just need to eat less what? Processed food and eat, exercise more. and exercise more and eat right. more vegetables. It's that simple, but it's still and hang not. Out with Laura Hart time. That's right, because you know what? Food is medicine. Let food be thy medicine. Thy medicine be thy food. What do you think, Pete? What do you think, Peter? <laughs> what do you think? That's pretty good. Yes. Shall oh. we? Yeah. Let's, let's use Peter as an example. Let's you see if you can make him younger. <laughs> well, you know what? I'll tell you what. It is true that we can, we can stop the. Um, the aging process. The slow aging. Down. We can slow. Well, down. actually, I can't say stop because slow stop. Down. Yeah, you're right. Not slow down. Not stop. But all right, these are called telomeres, or it's tell. I was calling it telomeres, but they're actually telomeres. They're the little genetic strand, like chain links at the end of our genetic, our DNA. And through the right diet and exercise, if we exercise every day, did you see the latest research? Did you see the latest research on people living over age 90? Number one, they were getting 45 minutes of exercise a day. They were. They Intimacy, also. Coffee. They had right. They right. They had romance. They needed right coffee and a little schmaltz. And right. Yeah. And it was good after age sixty. Yeah. But this is. But this is the thing. After age sixty, it's okay to put five pounds on a decade. That means five pounds every ten years. Not what Americans now. Right. All of the above. Right. Exactly.